Former Coronation Street star Gray O'Brien has thanked his followers for their support as he admits he has a long way to go after battling cancer. The Scottish actor revealed last night that he had been receiving, and since ended, his treatment at Beetson with an emotional bell ringing video from the centre. Gray, who is best known for playing Tony Gordon on the ITV soap, said he was diagnosed three months ago after a trip to the doctor. About three months ago a trip to the doctors with swollen glands led to stage 4 tonsil cancer. Today marks the end of my treatment and I couldn't be more thankful to everyone who has supported me along the way. At Beatson underscore charity at crook underscore by hashtag cancer awareness hashtag tonsil cancer hashtag stay strong, fist, pig.twitter.com slash 4 gfm 4 The 51-year-old Glasgow-born actor said, about three months ago a trip to the doctors with swollen glands led to stage 4 tonsil cancer. Today marks the end of my treatment and I couldn't be more thankful to everyone who has supported me along the way. Floods of support began pouring in for the actor, who has since said he has been humbled by the response. I have been totally humbled by the response from my tweet. Although this is the end of my treatment I still have a long way to go in my recovery. Best wishes to anyone who is just about to start this journey. This picture was taken on my first day. Hashtag cancer awareness hashtag tonsil cancer pic.twitter.com slash jd67kix9m. Sharing an image of him wearing a straight out a chemo top taken on his first day of treatment, he wrote, I have been totally humbled by the response from my tweet. Although this is the end of my treatment, I still have a long way to go in my recovery. Best wishes to anyone who is just about to start this journey. Gray, a graduate of the Royal Scottish Academy of Music and Drama now known as the Royal Conservatoire of Scotland, is one of Scotland's biggest screen stars with roles in peak practice, casualty, taggart, and the lock. For more on this story, visit the news article link.